let's take a look at on-the-job training. On-the-job training, known as OTJ, is done at the work site with the resources the employee uses to perform the job. The manager, or an employee selected by the manager, usually conducts the training one-on-one -on -one with the trainee. Because of its proven record of success, Job Instructional Training, JIT, a specific type of on-the-job training, is a popular type of training used worldwide. JIT has four steps, presented and described here. The first, prepare the trainee, followed by trainer presentation. Then, the trainee performs the task with follow-up. Let's take a look. Step 1, Preparation of the Trainee. Put the trainee at ease as you create interest in the job and encourage questions. Explain the objectives and quality and quantity of requirements and discuss their importance. Step 2. Presentation of the task by the trainer. Perform the task slowly, explaining each step several times. Once the trainee seems to have the steps memorized, have the trainee explain each step as you perform the task. Prepare a written list of steps in complex tasks and give a copy to the trainee. Step 3. Performance of the task by the trainee. Have the trainee perform the task slowly while explaining each step. Correct any errors and be willing to help the trainee perform any difficult steps. Continue until the employee can perform the task proficiently. Finally, Step 4. Follow-up. Tell the trainee who's available to provide help with any questions or problems. Gradually give the trainee more autonomy. Begin by checking on quality and quantity frequently. Then decrease the amount of checking based on the trainee's skill level. Watch the trainee perform the task and be sure to correct any errors or faulty work procedures before they become habits. Be patient and encouraging. Even though OTJ is a fairly expensive on a per-person basis, many organizations still use it heavily because of the fact that it works very well.